I don't put things inside me. Don't look at me like that. I don't put things inside me. I don't! Apart from food, fruit, a carrot, maybe. Not that way. We gotta get this guy. I need to get out of here. Fight the champion and prove he's responsible for all this. Prove our innocence. Then once that's all over, I'm gonna take the biggest dump of my life. Hey, hey, Billy. Hey, hey, Billy. What? Why the one handed man cross the road? I don't care. To get to the second hand store. <laughs> Why the baker stop making donuts? Well, yeah, I just don't care. You get tired of the whole thing. <laughs> Okay. How do you make an egg roll? You push it. Yeah, push it! <laughs> help! I can't breathe properly! You gotta help me! But you're, you're clearly breathing right now. Well... Shit. My stomach hurts! His stomach hurts? Hurry, open it up! Okay, so where's the head? Uh, in the stomach area. Uh, same fine to me, bruh. I'm sure I'd be fine. Bye. Link. Link, what are you doing? What? 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 You're supposed to jump on him. Yeah, well, I was tired, so what are you gonna do? You know what? Screw it. Uh... Link, go! Link! <gasps> what? This is so hard for a man to sleep in peace nowadays. Go! Go where? I'm helping you escape! You're the only one who can do this. Defeat the ranky champion. Prove her innocent. Alright, Jesus Christ, Mr. Serious. Hurry! I'm going. Why isn't there guards around here anyway? They're on the cafeteria. It was our lunch break. Sweet. Wait, what am I doing again? Sorry, I'm half asleep, to be honest. Just go to the Smash Championship! Oh, yeah, okay. Panania! Hey! Hello! I'm currently ranked two. I want to fight a champion right now. Right now. But, 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 sir, I mean... If you don't do it right now, I'll be very mad. And I will send a very angry letter of complaint to your superior. That's what I thought. Let's get ready to... Whoa! Hold on a second. Aren't you Link? No. Are you sure? Link's my, uh, Link's my friend. We dress like each other sometimes, just for fun. It is quite fun if you're a part of it, to be honest. But you wouldn't know because you're not. Okay, sorry. Welcome to the championship fight! Introducing Link's friend who dresses like him sometimes or something. His opponent! <sighs> Kept you waiting, huh? The snake? What are you doing here? I'm here for my rank B championship game. Who is this guy? Uh, it's actually an old friend of mine. You're my opponent, Link. I think you've gone to the wrong place, mate. I know we're old friends, but eat my grenade! Snake, this is the rank E. What? Yeah, so if that grenade kills someone, then you go, oh, you've nice one. Now you're going to, yep, now you're going to jail. Yep, okay. Bye, Snake. Let's, let, let's start again. Welcome, everybody, to the E rank championship fight final thing. That'll do. Introducing Link's friend, his opponent, the current E rank champion. What? You've got to be kidding me. You're the champion of rank E. The secretary guy? Hey, that's Mr. Secretary guy to you. I know it's gotta be you pulling the strings. Why? Why? So many reasons. Well, more like two. You don't even know who I am, do you? Yes? You're the secretary guy from the rank E. No! Okay, can't blame a guy for trying. Although technically you are the secretary guy. Shut up! What's my name? You look a bit like a Gary. Max. Max Gary, they're pretty similar. Quiet! Do you remember when you were the rank A champion? Well, how could I not? Then how could you forget me? Huh? I was your personal secretary. I brought you drinks. I arranged your meetings. I bathed you! And you didn't have the courtesy to say hello to me. You bathed me? Yes! I let you do that? Yes! Naked? Yes! Was I drunk? Stop it! When you came in for that first time, I was filled with glee. But you didn't recognize me. And then you lost against the tree. I've been champion for a while now. And thanks to the championship rule, I figured, hey, I'll get my revenge. If I fight you in the championship, I can kill you. And there'll be no consequences. So, I gave you motive. I had your friend injured. I used the leap of minions to put the blame on him. Why would you do that? I'm his private secretary of the side job. And he treats me like shit. I'm not having a good time, are you? Well, all that's about to change when I get my revenge! Announcer! Yellow. I want to fight to the death. A fight to the death has not occurred in two years! Well, now it is occurring. And trust me, it'll be a big occurrence. If that's how you want to go, then fine. Just don't blame me when you're bathing Satan in hell. Fight!
now, Link. I may have just bathed you and washed your nipples, but now I am supreme! You are a disgrace for the championship! And now you're mine. You're my little bitch now. And this... THIS IS THE END FOR YOU, LINK! <laughs> if you've got any more problems with me, take it up with my secretary. <laughs> <laughs> And that was the end of that. Thankfully, Shy Guy Max didn't die. Instead, he was taken in and questioned. He confessed to everything, and currently serves in prison as a private secretary to some butch inmate. Kind of feel sorry for the little guy. It's my fault his heart was filled with vengeance, but you know, I'll get over it. I mean, I forgot about him once, I'm sure I'll forget about him again. As for Jigglypuff, he, she, whatever, was set free. And he's still currently champion of rank A. As for Game & Watch, his wounds healed. And he went on to go back to the championship. He's still fighting now to reclaim his title. Unfortunately for the guy, he did break up with his wife, Chansey. But on the other hand, he did marry another Chansey straight afterwards. As for me, I got back together with Chansey. I realized she isn't perfect, but she was there for me. So, I decided to give things another go with her. Well, until I get mad and probably kill her. Right now, I've quit being a contender. My milk addiction has stopped. And thanks to the money that I've earned from being the E-Rank Champion, I'm pretty stable right now. I'm content with life. I will say I've learned a valuable lesson through this experience. It's funny how, how much we impact someone's lives without even realizing it, without even knowing or remembering. We can be completely oblivious to someone, yet to someone else, we're the only person on their mind. For example, as Chansey hugs me right now, I'm thinking about punching her in the face, over and over. Oh wait, I'm doing it now, aren't I? I am punching her in the face. I can't really help it. It is pretty fun, let's be honest. I'm sure she enjoys it. Listen to her. Chelsea! 